Encore, and today I am here with Kinoi. Um, so thank you all so much for um, emailing your photos, uploading your photos, um, stuff like that. I really appreciate it. So it was Colors Week, so let's talk about the photos and do best of autumn too, shall we? Our first photo is by Marie Grace, and her color was white. So as you can see in the photo, she is snuggled up by a blanket and her teddy bear. I also like the hint of purple. It really goes well with that white color and the purple in her hair and then her top. It just really goes well. The lighting is a little bit bright, so I would tone that down a little bit. But, and her eyes are looking straight at the camera. I really appreciate that and it's really good. So great job this week. This photo is by Carolina. Um, her color was blue. Um, I just zoom in a little bit because, you know, I mean, it's not. I feel like it's focusing more on the tree than the doll. So if you would just like maybe zoom in on the doll a little bit more. I like how you blurred out the background, but the house and the cars is a little bit distracting, but you know, you can't really do stuff like that because, I mean, it's a good picture. So, good job this week. Photo is by Lucy Anna. So, the fireworks, oh my gosh, that just brings out the picture to me. Her color was red, white, and blue. To the flag, to the pillow, to her clothes, and the fireworks. I have nothing to complain about this photo. It is the most adorable thing in the world. Congratulations. Oh my gosh, I, there's nothing to complain about about this photo. Next photo is by Anna and her color was yellow. Um, she's looking off into the distance a little bit. I don't know if she's supposed to be doing that, but, and her glasses are a little off. But I like the two piece crop top and the scrunchie. I know the shoes are purple, but you know, not going to take points away from that because it's kind of hard to um, find the right shoes and it has a little color pop to it. Um, I like the blurred out trees. I like how you use like a portrait photo so the trees doesn't like, take away. And then the lines on the street with the yellow was really good. So you did a really good job this week. The next photo is by Mary Ellen. Her color was green. I don't know. This color doesn't really scream green to me. I mean, I like the color pop in the sunglasses, and I also like how her hair is like to the side, but it doesn't really scream green to me. I mean, I like the top and all, but you know, I mean, it doesn't really scream green to me, but it is a really cute photo. It just doesn't really match the theme, I guess for what you were going for, but otherwise it was a really cute photo and you did a good job. Next photo is by Grace. Um, her color was pink, as you can see. Um, I love the balloons that are edited in and the sunglasses. I'm not sure if they were edited in or not. To the top and the sparkly bottoms. Yes, I love the sparkly bottoms. You did a really good job this week. Um, I just think that if you put like a headband, a pink headband in her hair, that would like bring it out a little bit more. But you did a really good job and I don't really have any complaints about this photo. It is really cute. Next photo is by Princess Elizabeth. Let me know down in the comments if you want me to call her Princess Elizabeth or just Elizabeth. So her color was like rainbow themed. This, um, this photo is really distracting to me. It is a really cute photo, let me say that, but it is distracting. It's taking away focus from the doll, and it's more like on the colors. So I just say next time, tone it down a little bit, but this is a really cute photo. So yeah, that was my only complaint. And I also like how she is staring into the camera, not looking off into the distance. So good job. Next photo is by Adeline Rose. And you may be able to tell that Grace and Adeline Rose are wearing the same pants. Oh, her color is pink, by the way. 
the flower crown, which is a mixture of pinks. I really like that. And the car, the pink car. Good job on that. The shirt that has a little dog on it, and then the socks that look pink, but I think they're actually white. And then the sky in the background. It is a really cute photo. Also the lines on her face, like the pink little dots that like are glowing is really cute. So, and she's staring right at the photo. So I really don't have any complaints about this photo except for like, for the um, shirt. I just say make it a little bit more pink, I guess, because I mean, the white is kind of bringing out the color, but I like the color pop in it too. So you did a really good job this week. This photo is by Lucy. Her colors were, were green and blue. I like the flowers around her. Like she's tangled up in the flowers that really brought it out. I love the color pop in the flowers and then her outfit. I like the filter too. I just say make sure that the her hair is out of her eye because it's kind of not because you kind of can't see one of her eyes but otherwise you did a really good job and I like how her hair is like poofed up right there it's like she's I'm here so you did a really good job this week good job next photo is by Rebecca and her colors were like blue and purple I think and a little bit of pink. She's not looking directly at the photo. I know it's kind of hard to do it like that, but you know, this photo is kind of plain to me. Next time, put a little bit more detail into it. I know you might have been like busy with school, after school curriculars and stuff like that. But I mean, it's a really pretty photo, but I just put a little bit more detail into it. And I like the romper straps. I have that outfit and it's really cute. So yeah, I just put a little bit more detail in it. So good job this week though. It's really cute. The next photo is by Mel and her color was purple. I just say, I mean, the edit on this is like taking away the color, I guess. So make sure it's like a little bit more bright. I like the how she's holding her hair and the bow on the dress and then the flowers and then how she has the lei wrapped around. That is really cute. And then the sweater as well. I just say like, just make sure that next time the filter does not bring away like out of the color. So yeah, but you did a really good job this week. This photo is really cute and it really stood out to me. Last photo is by Leah and her color was like more of blue, but some other colors. The water, it looks so edited, but I know that it's not because you told me that it's not edited. That's your real pool. Um, the screen in the background, it's, um, I can kind of see it, but I know you were kind of trying to block it with a doll. There are some shadows under her eyes, so I just say fix that next time. I love the blue sequins dress, and then the floaties in the pool. And also the water shooting out, that was really cute. The next time I just say make sure that the shadows are taken care of, but this was a really, really cute photo. It's time for best to bottom two. You guys did a really good job this week, so I don't want you to take this too seriously. So there will always be a next time for you guys, but yes. The best photo of this week goes to Luciana. Congratulations. To Adeline Rose, Leah, Lucy, Marie Grace, Grace, Anna, Mel, Carolina, Mary Ellen, and the bottom two are Princess Elizabeth and Rebecca. The bottom two are in no particular order. So to Princess Elizabeth and Rebecca, Rebecca, your photo just didn't, you know, fit like detail and stuff. And Princess Elizabeth, yours was a little bit too distracting. But yeah, there will, nobody will be eliminated this round because I could not choose 
who should be eliminated. So, yeah. You guys did a really good job this week. So, you know. Yeah. The next theme is Nature Week. So, yeah, that is due May 26th, and that is a Sunday. So, yeah, get creative with Nature Week. Make it very nature -y. It could be, like, in the woods or by a tree. Here is a... Uh, a picture that you can look at to get ideas from. I can't. Okay. Here we go. So yeah, that is due May 26th and that is a Sunday. Get creative. Either send it to my email or post it on your channel. So yeah, I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you next time. Goodbye.